Okay, here's the parts for Black Magic Woman. So starting on the first, uh, sorry, the 13th fret on the second string. Oops, I missed it. So you're going 13th fret, then 15th fret. 12th fret is the double dotted one. So we're one fret up from that. So it's 13th, 5th fret, 13th, 15th. Then this is the 14th fret on the third string. So that's the pattern except for, I think the third time around, you move one of them, watch this. Oops, yep. Again, slowly, getting closer to the camera, here we go. And do that over and over. You don't have to wiggle it. <laughs> so then you go. I'm gonna break that down even slower. So it's so that's the first six notes are just that same pattern twice. Thirteenth, fifteenth. 14th on the third string. Let me repeat that. And then after that, you're going to go down to the 12th fret over here. So then I think you repeat right there. Yeah. Yeah. Again, slowly, but with no talking. That's So that's the keyboard part, and you play it on guitar. So if you listen to the original, that's a little organ part. It just... You're going to actually do that um, through the first probably 45 seconds of the song, so for quite a while, but it's very easy. And then <clears throat> I think there'll be times where it makes sense for you to play the bass line with Tony. And it's fun anyway. So this is with the D string open, fourth string, and then the same string on the seventh fret. And then I'm jumping over to the third string. That's fifth fret. Then it shifts all down one string to, to up, I guess, to the eight to the fifth string. And it's lower notes. So get those two patterns down, and then you have one more little pattern to know. So I'm just it's gonna move over to this G. If you look closely, you should be able to figure that out. G, I'm on the third fret there. So here's the whole pattern. It goes two of D. 2 of A, 2 of D, 2 of G, and then D, A, D. Anyway, here it goes. I didn't do that without mistake, but there it is. I'm gonna do it one more time through a little bit slower. I'll probably write this pattern down below. It's D, D, A, A, D, 
D, G, G, D, A, D. There we go. So those are two of the main parts you need to know. Um, that's really about it for the song. Uh, we may work out a couple other parts. You can also do the chords. They're just... So this is a D, this is a D minor. Um, it's just like your normal D, but what's on the first string is going to get dropped over to there, so your fingers all swap around. Um... First string with this finger, first fret. Third string, second fret. Second string, third fret. D minor. And this is A minor 7. We're not playing the lowest string, so I'm muting it with my thumb. And then, just like an A minor, but pick up that, pick up that third string finger so it's open. It gives you an A7, so... D minor, A minor 7, and then G. Um, so there are other little parts, um, but learn those first. <laughs> 